We're getting freaking tattoos. That's just crazy to me. Friday, it's payday. People got money to blow. They're gonna go get them a tattoo. Here we go, we're getting our first tattoos. How far out do they book? Is it gonna hurt? I'm nervous. I'm gonna have to act like this doesn't hurt at all <laughs> so that you will still do it. Oh my gosh, you're gonna be fine, it doesn't hurt. Wishing you picked a different font now, aren't you? Nope. See, he's having to like wiggle around a little on yeah. New York. <laughs> I'm in New York right now. Good afternoon and welcome to the vlog. Pulled up to the tattoo parlor. <laughs> Cullen is actually meeting me here. I just had a doctor's appointment and just got done with that. And so we had a meet up. Here he comes. He just pulled up. It looks like it's bumping and like packed today. I'm not real sure. We're actually going to have time to do this. This is all service by appointment only really yeah. nuts can you walk up and ask for an appointment <laughs> probably too late we totally should have asked i was gonna write him yesterday and asked but I then i was like no i know both of us why didn't we just trust ourselves and do what we said we should do to get here and get this done yeah, it looks like there's like people waiting I know. It's this place is packed bumping that's what i'm like it is bumping i wonder if it's like you said it's like friday it's payday People got money to blow. They're gonna go get them a tattoo. I mean, do you wanna go ask? Like, how far out do they book? Let me go check. Okay, you wanna, I'll just wait here? Okay, I'm just gonna wait here. You want me to just wait here? Uh, sure. Okay, so, yeah, we thought we could just roll up in here and get a tattoo. <laughs> no, we had talked about how they might not be able to like actually do it today if we just walked in. Um, the place that we looked at it said that they did take walk-ins. I don't know if that was like old information, maybe pre-COVID type stuff. But we had said like, even if we go in or like pull up and walk in and they can't take us today, we would love to just like talk to them and kind of get an idea of like, what's the procedure? Is there a certain like person that would be better for this? And then be like, look, I know y'all do some like really serious tattoos, like big ones that are important and these are just little tiny words, so probably shouldn't really matter that much. But it's our first ones and be nice to us. So anyways, um, we're just going to see. We're going to see. He's talking to the guy back there right now. At the window there, talking to the guy. I'm turned around backwards. It's kind of hard. All right, what'd they say? They said it is by appointment only, and it says cash only too up there. Oh, well dang. So, so we'd been screwed either way. <laughs> um, and then I said... Me and my wife just want to get something. And then he said, sometimes they'll have cancellations, but you have to book, depending on the artist. Some book a month out, some booking to, uh, are booking into August. I was like, you don't have anything like immediate? <laughs> he was like, well, not unless there's a cancellation or anything. But you can go on, he said the best bet is <clears throat> to go on Facebook and message them. That's and, what I was gonna do yesterday. And say what you want say me and my wife just want something small he said is it big or small that you want and I said just small and then he said say what you want say where it is and if you have the uh, font upload that and then somebody will get back with you well dang you want to go somewhere else <laughs> I don't know it's almost like do you, would it be worth it I mean it's but would it also just since it's so simple would it be okay just to go somewhere else I know that's what I'm like it's not like it's a big thing but you don't want to go somewhere janky like i just feel like they just do so good here well for the big i mean yeah yeah it is something little but it is also still gonna be on your body forever so i don't want it i don't know i mean honestly like you said like anybody could probably do it let's look up some other places and see what and just call before we go okay that's a good idea and then just say like do y'all have let me need openings we have an hour <laughs> do we have to pick up our <laughs> No, we got like an hour and we got like almost two hours. So, I mean, we had left enough time if we could just walk in, but. This place is obviously popping there. It's crazy. Interesting. Okay. Well, who knew that um, tattoos were such high demand? <laughs> uh, we looked at another place that's nearby and they said, their website said basically the same thing, that they're like super full and booked and you do have to have an appointment and they're not like taking new appointments till June or maybe one artist there wasn't taking new appointments till June. I'm something. sure everybody watching too is like, duh, y'all have to make an appointment. What are you crazy? But well, like you I hear those know. stories about like me and Darlene went out after don't dinner <laughs> on the beach one night and got ourselves a tattoo and it's just like you up and go get a tattoo when you want one. Yeah. I guess not. 
And I mean, maybe it's... COVID probably has a lot to do with it, too. I think COVID probably does. But then I also wonder, like, this place is only open from, like, noon to 8 p.m. There's other places, like, I saw a place down closer to the beach that's open from 1 p.m. to 12 a.m. I would imagine this time of day, afternoon, people are going during the daytime, is more popular for, like, the appointment hour. Mm -hmm. And then I doubt there's, I mean, maybe there are, but I doubt there's many people that make an appointment for, like, 11 o'clock at night. So maybe it's, that's more of the time when you tend to, like, walk in. I don't know. I've never just been up in a tattoo place. Place, but I don't <laughs> usually I pulled up and did not expect to see there be there's like probably 20 cars here yeah it's crazy I think we're gonna set up an appointment and then I mean that'll be good too because then we'll know when it's coming we can make sure we're like completely ready and practice some more practice some more and all that stuff I don't want it to get too close to summer though because you gotta keep it dry for a minute you can't like soak it in the pool and I like to soak in the pool maybe that's another reason everybody's getting their summer <clears throat> tattoos ready that's true Sun's out, gun's out. All right, well, did anything else we need to tell no, them? That's it. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. Attempt number two. We're going to try another walk in tattoo parlor. Supposedly, according to their Facebook page and everything like that, they do take walk ins, so we'll see. We've got an appointment set up. We've got two appointments set up at two different locations just to get it locked in for those dates if this second attempt at getting our tattoos falls through. We're getting freaking tattoos. That's just crazy to me. All right, we came to this hole in the wall kind of place but those are usually supposedly the best kind and they are open and they accept walk-ins and they're cool with us filming it so here we go we're getting our first tattoos is it gonna hurt I'm nervous we get them all over honestly you can go up you can go down i mean that's up to you really whenever you move your wrist all right just make the stencils they look good who's going first do it at the same time. Were you filming when we were like looking at our text uh -huh. and stuff? Like I write mine out. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's your handwriting. Yeah, I just crazy. decided to go with that. You can't chicken out though, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna have to, I know. I'm gonna have to act like this doesn't hurt at all so that you will still do it. <laughs> it's gonna be fun. Does it doesn't hurt at all. That's what the deal is. So we just have to right? Yeah, I'm thinking like not all the way under that line, but like, you know, here. Mm -hmm. No, I had Errol Marm right there, but I guess I did. <laughs> well, you just have little baby yeah, ears and you don't want them to get pushed into the tattoo. Yeah. So interesting how this works. I know. So intrigued. I like that a lot. Now you can tell it's straight. <laughs> yeah, 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 it yeah. is. It is. It's it the bottom of that different. paper looks like uh -huh. that, for sure. I like it. All right, got the needle. Oh my gosh, this is the part that gives me the heebie jeebies. Oh, man. It's just quiet though. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, that was it? It was on? It was on. Oh, jeez. Oh, well. oh yeah, it's not that loud. <gasps> yeah. Do I need to like make sure I stay really, really still? What do I do? No, you're good. All right. Just relax. Stand up and get the overhead. Oh my gosh, you're gonna be fine. It doesn't hurt. Like, it, I'm not even that? playing. It doesn't hurt that bad. <laughs> I know we just started, but it's gonna be all right. It's gonna be fine. Do good? I mean, you're gonna be fine. It doesn't <laughs> hurt at all. <laughs> I mean, it's really, it's really not. It's not terrible. I mean, it's not that bad. It hurts a little bit, but it's not. It's not terrible. I mean, it's really not that bad. <laughs> Are you just trying to talk me out of it? Are you talking me into it? <laughs> I think I do have a bit of a high, higher pain tolerance than you do, though. All women do. Yeah. yeah. He's already on the second word. Yeah. I think you're gonna be surprised at how much it how much it doesn't hurt as much as you think it's going to. What happens? You don't. You don't remember the pain. Really? At all. Like you'll come back and get a way bigger piece and be like, I do not remember. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, you'll be like, I do not remember it ever. So that's it? I think that's because it's the expectation of the initial. You're like expecting it to be terrible and it's not. And, and when you come back, you're down, like, oh, yeah. it wasn't that bad. And now you think it's awful. So were the eyebrows worse? Look at that. Um, they only because it took way longer. I mean, I laid there for like an hour doing my eyebrows and this was like, that was it? And we're done? How's it up? That so looks so crazy. good. I love it. That is amazing. That yeah. looks so good. Yeah, perfect. I love it. You did an awesome job. <laughs> awesome, thank you. It really is not that bad. I didn't cry or make a bad face, right? Wasn't I smiling the whole time? <laughs> There so you go. It's the, um, let's see. Look at that. That looks so cool. I love that it's in my handwriting too. Yeah. I think that's kind of cool. 
I think yours is yours is gonna be a little thicker too though, so now your needle might hurt a little more. No, it'll be good. It'll be good. <laughs> no? Okay. It won't be that bad. Okay. I'm nervous. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fine. Doesn't hurt at all. It's fine. Are you kidding? What? They go, what? what? Regulators? Well, certainly what? I have. I'm like, yeah, you have. what? I don't recognize the words that much like what you just been saying. <laughs> Everybody knows every word in this song. <laughs> right. Really? I mean, every word. I must have missed this one. Maybe a little bit lower. Yeah, right there is good. It's so crazy. Yeah. You like that placement? Okay. And it's obviously not going to all run together that much. <laughs> no, not at all. That's just a stencil. His is going to be a little bit thicker than yours just because of the font that we use. Mm -hmm. Yours is more like a pencil. You just wrote it out your handwriting. Right? Yeah, and yeah. And his will be like it got typed on him. Okay. There you go. That's so cool. Yeah. That's good. Okay. Good. Go. See, now this is where I'm, I'm like, how do you n know exactly where to do do it when it all is so like thick with the stencil. Go right in the middle. You should go right in the middle of it. Okay. Because you can see your needle. I set my needle because I don't use the. Tip Do you mind of if I film this? This is interesting. Okay, no, good. I, <laughs> I don't use the tip of my uh, needles. I mean, the tip of my the tip on the needle. Uh -huh. I use the actual needle so I can watch the needle where it goes. Uh, okay. Instead of pushing the tip all the way to there and you really don't know where your needle is. Yeah. At, I use the pull it out a good bit and use just the needle. Okay. It's kind of like using a skill saw. Like yeah, you can either use just the blade. Yeah, are you you line it up? That's guide. what I would do. But I would half the time I would pull it up and then just yeah. stay right on line, freehand essentially, yeah. and make a smoother cut. Yeah, yeah. exactly. That's how you can smooth it. That E got me good. <laughs> See, he's having to like wiggle around a little on yours. Yeah. Mine was just straight lines. That's what so I was saying. Good. Your little accent pieces. Wishing you picked a different font now, aren't you? Nope. <laughs> gonna make me look bad. No, women makes any man look bad and never comes to touch you. Women are way stronger than guys. <laughs> I mean, I can't argue with that. But you're already on the second word. Yep. I'm in New York. <laughs> I'm in New York right now. In, the cold. in New York with Buddy the Elf running through the traffic. Is <laughs> oh. that a little better on the second word than the. Third? Yeah, yeah. Huh? So you have quite a few minutes for the rest of it. Really? Mm hmm. Yeah, give him an excuse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's got a damn. What was the dragon under chest? <laughs> Colored in. Good lord. <laughs> you <laughs> I know, right? Good. <laughs> <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Alright, that's it. See? Right, roller coaster ride. <laughs> <laughs> All kind of emotions still coming in. <laughs> that's so crazy. Yeah. Ooh. And then now it doesn't hurt anymore. I mean, None. you good now. Oh, I love that. Freaking text, though. Oh, that's right. Oh, you're on the perfect. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. Dude, you did good. That looks so good. I love it. Damn. All right, there it is. There we are. It. We did it. Oh man, that was uh, quick and easy. Did you give him a tip? All right, if y'all are in the area, come check them out. Slip Aid Studios. We'll be back. And it's uh. Come get another one next week. Slip Aid Studio, how may I help you? This is Zach and Matt, right? Yes, sir. Cool, yes, sir. cool. Check them out. That was nice. Thank y'all. Awesome to meet y'all. Nice to meet y'all. Nice we have yeah. tattoos. You kind of saw maybe what they were in between, and we just held them up maybe for a thumbnail in there. I don't know. Yes. But. We showed them, and I guess, yeah, so the whole, obviously mine, if you haven't been following for a while, the trust yourself, like, theme for my life has been the theme that started the changes in my life back in 2000, the end of 2018, I created, like, trust yourself merch, and I actually had somebody else write trust yourself for me for the merch, and then as I was practicing, like, that I wanted to write that on me, I was going to use a font. And then I said, you know what? I actually kind of like seeing it in my handwriting because it's a very like meaningful um, phrase and concept for me. Yeah, so, it's really yeah. cool. I like the the authenticity of it. And then, and then yours. Wanting to get a Wi-Fi button or a play well, button. Well, first you start looking at scorpions because you're Scorpio. Scorpio, uh -huh. birthday, something mean of, meaningful, obviously. And then we we're on our date night. You we were like, oh, I could get like a Wi-Fi signal like Charles Trippy has. Yeah, that might be cool. <laughs> yeah. And then I walked off to the bathroom and I was like, I mean, I see his point because 
like that's your job and then I thought and then some people do like the YouTube play button like you know because you're a creator and then I was like create oh create what if he just did like create the word create sorry I'm wiping I don't know can you hold it I think that's a combination of blood and the stencil and I think you started searching create tattoos create tattoos and then I found one that said create yourself and I was like oh my god trust yourself create yourself and then it kind of goes back to our whole story and my whole story about like creating content for YouTube and social media and then how it all started trusting myself to take the leap to create myself basically like how we've changed so much in our lives and you're pretty much creating a new you and creating a new life right yeah. now so it's like kind of taking away from that whole you got to follow the norms of society and follow it like you have to get a nine to five job and whatever else you can create the life that you want and that's what you're doing and that's what you've done and like on top of your creative nature it was just the perfect, perfect perfect thing Trust when yourself. you found that and you were like oh my god create yourself i know i was so, freaking yeah. out i had chills and everything you're not necessarily trying to find yourself you're creating yourself yeah you don't life. have to you're not you're not necessarily lost it's just a process of creating who you're supposed to be yeah when we started talking about it at the beach we were like should we do a couples thing like i don't want to be cheesy and like it match i'm not that it's cheesy if you have that i'm just saying for our first one i wanted to do it as something like meaningful to me personally yeah but now it totally coordinates and i like how it, it matches so but it cool. still is individual to our right. own selves it's still but us. it still matches i'm ready to get another one now you want to go back in there let's talk about what we're gonna do next <laughs> that guy was cool i like him zach yeah zach, zach was nice. Manette, alabama after all the places we've called and tried to go to and like people are booking out months and weeks and whatever the main holdup of not going somewhere uh that was booking out because we had found some places we wanted to go was like it's gonna get closer to summer and we were we're gonna be going to the beach and we didn't want to not be able to be with our kids in the pool can't get, yeah i can't swim for two weeks no yeah. submerging i so. feel like since we've had it on with sharpies before i'm, I'm literally gonna smear it every time i touch it i know i mean too i was standing there and i was like this and he was probably like you can move your arm <laughs> anyways those yeah. are our tattoos we did it babe i love you i love you too i can't believe that we just freaking got tattoos i know after all these years we're 38. we need to cancel the other two appointments thank y'all so much for your excitement for us it's been fun to share this with y'all and y'all have all been excited for us too so the ground see how the healing process goes over the next week or so i don't know let us know what we should get next I never told him the story of what i was actually going to get i'll tell that in a different video yeah don't forget to be confident stay con trust yourself and create yourself amen <laughs>